you just witnessed there was a small montage of all of the current video and photo of the Kuhn DLC that Giants have produced. What we're going to do now is take a look at all of the fact sheets going from 1 through 7. So the first fact sheet here we have the Kuhn Performer 4000 and this is a cultivator with a price of $13,000. The maintenance fee is $5 per day and the required power to operate this cultivator is 240 horsepower. The working width of this machine is 4 meters and its operating speed is 10 miles per hour. Moving further down the page, the Kuhn Discolander XM52 is also a cultivator with a price of $35,000. Maintenance fee is $15 per day and a required power of 220 horsepower. Working width is 6 meters and has an operating speed of 10 meters. Fact sheet number two, we have the Kuhn BTF 4000, which is a seed drill with a price of $14,000 and a maintenance fee of $50 per day. It is fairly cheap. It also has a required power of 100 horsepower with a working width of 4 meters, operating speed 9 miles per hour, and can take many seeds from wheat through to grass. However, it does require the TF 1500, which ironically is below. So this is a seed hopper with a price of $11,000, maintenance fee of $5 per day and a capacity of 1,500 litres and it can hold all of the seeds which the above machine can hold. Moving on to fact sheet number 3, we have another cultivator. This has a price of $10,000 with a maintenance fee of $5 per day. Its required power is 130 horsepower with a working width of 4 meters and operating speed of 7 miles per hour. It adds a plow state bonus which increases the yield by 10%. Below that we have the Kuhn HR4004 which yet again is another cultivator. With a price of $18,000 and maintenance fee of $5 per day, it's a bit more expensive than the one above, however it does not add the plow state. It does all though, require 100 horsepower, it has a working width of 4 meters and its operating speed is 9 miles per hour. Moving on to fact sheet number 5, as I can't find number 4 anywhere, we have the Kuhn LSB 1290D. Now this is a baler at a price of $105,000 and maintenance fee of $140 per day, it's fairly expensive. However, the required power is 185 horsepower, its capacity 4,000 litres, and its operating speed is 12 miles per hour. Next up we have the Kuhn FBP3135, which is a bale wrapper. The price is $135,000, with a maintenance fee of $210 per day. The required power is 140 horsepower, with a capacity of 4,000 litres. Its operating speed is 12 miles per hour and can do straw, grass and hay. It does have a configura uh, configuration option of changing the foil colour and from the videos we've seen we can guess that one is white and pink. The category below that uh, is it, well, sorry, the machine below that is Kuhn SW4014 which is a bale wrapper. With a price of $54,000, maintenance fee of $220 per day, and can hold and can do square or round bales. And again, it has the configuration option of the foil colour. Moving on to fact sheet number six, we have a mower. Now, this mower is priced at $16,000 with a maintenance fee of $20 per day. The required power is 80 horsepower with a working width of 4.3 meters and its operating speed at 13 miles per hour. Next up we have a, the Kuhn GF8702, which is a tether. This is priced at $16,000 again, maintenance fee of $35 per day. The required horsepower is 40 horsepower, with a working width of 8.7 meters and operating speed of 11 miles per hour. We now have the Kuhn Merge MAXX902. And this is a windrower. Price is $102,000 with a maintenance fee of $50 per day. Required power to operate this windrower is 140 horsepower, has a working width of 9.1 meters, and an operating speed of 14 miles per hour. 
Now the next fact sheet number seven, we have the Kuhn Axis 40.2 M EMC W, which is a fertilizer spreader. With the price of $24,000, maintenance fee of $70 per day, working with 24 meters, operating speed 12 miles per hour, and a capacity of 3,200 liters. Now last but not least, we have the Kuhn Metris 4102, which is a sprayer. Its price is $84,000, with a maintenance fee of $200 per day, working width of 36 meters, operating speed of 9 miles per hour, and a capacity of 4,100 liters. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to check out fsuk.com, the Farming Sim UK Facebook and Twitter pages, and also JH Gaming videos, and that's my YouTube channel where you will be able to see these mods and maps in action. Also, don't forget to subscribe, and then you'll be the first to know of future videos. Once again, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.